product we're looking at today is the Beery Motion by Beery Technologies. It's a hands-free Bluetooth cradle for your car. Uh, it suits the iPhone 3G, 3GS and 4. The version I'm going to look at today is version 2, which came out late last year, uh, 2010. To start with, I'm going to go through the uh, box, the cradle, the contents, uh, the connections, uh, and the mounting options. Uh, then we'll go out to the vehicle. We'll have a look at how to make a phone call, how to receive a call, how to play music, and navigation. To start with, we have the cradle here on the right, taking it out of the box. You can see uh, just a bit of a close-up. Very nice, solid design, standard uh, sort of design for a Bury cradle. On the left here, you can see a few buttons on the outside of the cradle, volume up, volume down, and then a, uh, a function button or a, an answer call, hang up call button. Looking at the top side, you have a cradle release button. Pressing that button, clicks the cradle open. This is where you can insert your phone. Then click it closed again once your phone is in there. Looking down the bottom, you have a few connections, one for power, uh, one for microphone, it has an external microphone not built into the cradle just for better quality and the middle connector is for uh, auxiliary out or music out uh, that can then plug into your vehicle's headset. And just turning the cradle over you can see the back two speakers and this does your voice audio. Okay just placing this aside now taking the packaging off we see the contents of the box First we have the external microphone which is plugged into the bottom of the cradle. Then we've got the charging cable that plugs into the cigarette lighter in your car. We have one of the mounting options which is a windscreen mount. Uh, this end clicks onto your windscreen. Uh, really nice and firm, stable connection. Uh, this end you put the cradle on, clip the cradle in. Uh, it rotates around 270 degrees so you can look at the phone in portrait or landscape mode. And the other uh, mount is your adhesive dash mount, uh, the sticky pad on the bottom which mounts on your dash, uh, the cradle clips into uh, the head of the unit there. Um, one benefit with this is, or uh, well, with the two mounting options, a lot of people can use this one in their main vehicle and then in the secondary vehicle or more of a portable option uh, use the windscreen mount. The last item in the box is just the manual, a few hints and tips in there. Um, so I might now take you out to the vehicle and give you a demonstration of the Bury Motion in action. Okay, so here we have the Bury Motion uh, mounted using the windscreen mount in a vehicle. Um, as you can see, it's just up here to the top right. Um, windscreen mount over the back there. Just hidden down the corner here are the power and three and a half mil jack out wires. Um, then just at the front, you see the microphone. Just to the top of the iPhone, if that focuses, uh, you can see that uh, in the cradle, in the Bury Motion, the iPhone's charging. Um, also, it has the Bluetooth connected uh, for hands-free conversations. Moving out a little bit, uh, demonstrating a phone call. Now, phone calls can be made in two ways. Uh, the first way is by clicking on your phone book, then choosing uh, one of the contacts, whether they're recent or in your phone book, then it's just a matter of pressing on the contact. Uh, this is a local weather service and the call will be made. Welcome to the 1196 weather service. Pressing on the screen, pressing in finishes the call uh, and you just hear the audio that was coming out the back of the speakers. Now the other way to make a phone call is by pressing on the phone button on the Bury Motion and doing it via voice control. I'll just cancel out of that one though. That's the built-in Apple voice tags um, where you can dial anyone in your phone book or your recent or redialed numbers. Uh, after, after that you might want to listen to some music so pressing on your iPhone button takes you back to the main menu. Pressing on iPod then takes you into your music. Um, quite simply just pressing play plays music through your car's audio system uh, using the three and a half mil output. Nice and easy on the screen are the big controls, uh, very safe. Just to change music, uh, change tracks back and forth. The other benefit of the Bury Motion is being able to rotate it into landscape mode. Uh, here you can see 
with the music, you get your uh, album covers. While in landscape mode, you can then go out of your music, go into choose your navigation, your favorite navigation application, and here you can see Mirror Motion is now a portable navigation app. Music can then be played over the top of the navigation, turn-by-turn uh, -turn instructions uh, fade the music out uh, before giving you your instruction then fade the music back in. Uh, if you do receive a phone call in this time, the same thing, uh, the music and the navigation both fade out uh, and the phone call can then be accepted or rejected. So there you have it, the Bury Motion. Uh, very simple to use, feature rich uh, and very safe too with Bluetooth hands free.